What we have here, folks, is a new BMW M5. And boy, is is something spectacular. I mean, just look at it. The kidney grill. We have the new hybrid system built in this. And look at it handle that curve. This is something to behold, folks. I mean, the handling systems, the dynamics, the characterization that you have in this car is something else. You can change the experience you have up to at least three different ways how you can spec this vehicle as you're driving it. You can change the dynamics of it. And that's what makes this awesome, folks. The new BMW M5. What a vehicle, folks. A V8 engine with a classical high revving characteristics. Uh, together with the electric motor, performance characteristics are tuned specifically for the BMW M5, which is integrated into the A-speed m Steptronic transmission. Now, the combustion engine benefits from the cutting-edge M-twin power turbo technology. And the one thing I always notice about BMWs is that they are raw, and they are excellent and powerful vehicles. And they cost a hell of a lot of money. Now, I'm thinking that this one right here, back in the day, they started off like 91000 But I'm sure it's going to be more now. But they would run from 91000 to 130000 But I guarantee you this one will probably be like probably 105 all the way up to 150 in the competition spec. But still, if you can't afford it, it's going to be one awesome experience with a hybrid V8 endurance racing technology behind it. And again, you have the nice 20-inch tires up front, 21-inch in the, in the back. You have mad grip, as you can see, just lighting up the road, lighting up the corners and that. This is going to be one hell of a fun machine, folks. In all electric operating mode, this baby can hit speeds up to 87 miles per hour. The high voltage battery, which is located low in the car, underbody, for um, better balance, you get electric range up to 50 miles, folks. Or must we say 42 to 43 miles, which is unmatched. By any other any of the competition out there. Now the power generated by the combustion engine and the electric motor is channeled to the road of the all-wheel drive system, known as the MX drive. Its rear base setup, and particularly pronounced in the four-wheel drive sport mode. The driver can also select the two-wheel drive mode, and this is where you can light up the rear tires which this gentleman was doing earlier. Dynamic stability control system switched off and will appeal to the experienced driver who prefers that performance experience. So, remember back in the day, like Audi, you couldn't change it? Not like BMW. BMW, you can change it. And you can have fun. And you can let the dogs out, folks. Sophisticated tech ch chassis technology, which is something else. In specific tuning, uh, the chassis design of the BMW M5 comprises a double wishbone front axle and a five-link rear axle with the bespoke schematics and electro schematics, plus a host of other specially tuned components. Electrically assisted rack and pinion steering with the M servotronic and a variable steering ratio. I mean, look at that tire, folks. It's lighting up that road right there. Boy, boy. Now, you imagine one of those tires are probably $1,500 each. I could be wrong, but they're going to be up there. I would, th you know, I would think that one of those tires would be 1000 if not nine, eight hundred to $1,000 dollars a piece. And so if you got the money, you can just let it rip. Who gives, who gives a damn? Just have some fun. This is one machine, for, folks. Wow, now just look at some. Now, these are just the driving shots. And you're going to fall in love with the 
kidney grill. Everything about this is just phenomenal. The kidney grill is just nice, folks. And it, and it also lights up at night with the daytime running lamps. You have the kidney grill. So people are going to be able to see this from far away. And they're going to know you're driving a BMW M5. Traction, agility, and, and directional stability all benefit from the what they call the, the near actuator wheel slip limitation and networking of the all control systems with an integrated transverse dynamics management setup. Both the standard M compound brakes and the optional M carbon ceramic brakes combined with an integrated brake system that presents the driver with two paddle field setting. On the M light alloy wheels, which I talked about earlier, 20 inch up front, 21 inches in the back. These are performance tires. You have assistive systems for sure comfortable and driver. So when you're driving, you have the assistance that you need. And usually people got these kind of cars. They work, but they don't work too much. Perhaps if they work too much, if you're a lawyer, you're going to work a, a lot, folks. This is one awesome machine, folks. Thanks for watching. Remember, like, share, and subscribe, and have an awesome day. This is something awesome.